Yep. You on him, Zach? Is everyone on him? Zach, you record? Huh? Yep. Okay, Aaron, take your time. Rick, you ready? Take your time. Touch one off. Yeah, I just saw his head, it's shaped like a big, big triangle. Bear 30. That's a big bear. It's a big bear. That, that's not him. He's not oh, big. no, 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 that's not the same bear. He's long. It's bigger. Yeah, he's a big bear. It's a really big bear. He's feeding this way, though. Yeah. Right. We, we just gotta get on him before he gets back. I just ranged him. Is he behind a bunch of stuff now? He's gonna come out above that rock. Where's the range finder so I can get it quick? Between the rocks. Yeah, between the rocks, Aaron. Between the rocks. You need to yeah. zoom out and zoom in and find no. him again. I found him. You on him, Zach? Is everyone on him? Zach, you record? Huh? Yep. Okay, Aaron, take your time. Rick, you ready? Take your time. Touch one off. Where's I had on him? Check your bubble. Perfect elevation. You got him. I think you hit him. Dude, that is a giant bear. Giant. Like definitely over six. Did you see him when he stood up? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I hope I hit him good. Nah, you good. Good job, man. Great guy. Oh yeah. Oh, I he think he hit my shoulder. Yeah. 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 He I think him. so. How did he take the bullet like a champ like that? Big well, bear. Too. Big He's bear. Huge. He's a <laughs> freaking big bear, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. Oh my gosh. That's a big bear. Let's, let's do the piece of bullet. I think, it, dude, that the bullet didn't even, it barely shook him. I got it. Watch. Dude, it looked like it, it, looks like it hit it right in front of his head. Yeah, he like, he like does one of these. Unless it went right but past his head. But it went right past his head and just went like that. I think you hit right, yeah, I think you hit right behind him. It was perfect elevation, he's just, he's, I steps. mean, I'd really like a tall glass, like this tall, we'll just have to go. <laughs> like, and just free think everybody. Freak the cosmos. So Aaron, we think hammered this bear 
up at the top of this ridge. You're not going to be able to see it. We're just shooting on a cell phone here. But Zach and Aaron took a cough to make sure the bear didn't double back or they, they can't see him laying up there, but we're running out of daylight and we don't really want to track a wounded bear. But we're way back in here and I really don't want to come back in here, but it's kind of an eerie feeling. I mean, every one of these pockets has a bear in it. It's unreal. It's like there's a, there's a little leaf you'll see in the video that kind of flies off. And I don't know if the bear bumped that leaf or if the bullet came through and hit the bear. I don't know. But it's getting cold, it's getting dark, and uh, we're just gonna, Austin, cameraman, and I are just gonna hang tight until these guys go back. I'd like them to go to the top, but we'll see. It wasn't. So, what'd you, what'd you find? Uh, I'll turn my lamp on. Went up, and you know that bush that, he, that was in front of him, and Rick's phone scope showed the leaf fall off. Right. So, we were up, we were up there, we found it, because it was literally the only bush with uh, leaves on it. Uh -huh. And we saw where the bullet hit. That bullet hit like the biggest branch of that stupid bush. Oh, that's a thick branch, dude. Yeah, that's a out inch and all, a half. Out of all of them, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. no, it's a centimeter, it's a centimeter and a half. Green. Yeah, not about that. Thing. It deflected that bullet, dude. Yep. So no blood, no fur. Um, no blood. It's a Zero. Yeah, the thing is, dude, we know there's two giant bears in this canyon. There's two giant bears. And you hunt those giant bears to kill the giant, and you know what? You come in here the last couple weeks, can't find them. There's about 10 other bears you could kill in here. You leave Creek Aaron's down. That elk hunt where I ran out of water? Oh, yeah. I wanted to just lay down and fall asleep. You can't let yourself do it. You want to fall asleep or are you too sick to? No, I could fall asleep right here. Yeah, let's go. Well, it is now April 15th and a couple weeks into my bear hunt, we didn't get it done the first go around, so I'm headed out right now. Just finish up packing out and it's a nine, nine hour plus drive to get to where I'm hunting, so Got a long, long drive ahead of me. Um, it's not a very fun drive to make by yourself, which brings me to my next point. Uh, unfortunately, um, Eric can't make it out with me, and about 20 other people that I asked to go with me couldn't make it out with me, so I'm headed out solo. So. Should be pretty fun. I'm a little nervous uh, and very excited. So, here we go. Woo. My, uh, my biggest hope is that I don't get rained out the whole time because here in a couple hours it's supposed to start pouring and uh, supposedly it's supposed to rain for the next three days so I just hope I can get a break in the weather so that I can get this done and it's not completely miserable. <laughs>
I just shot my first bear. I'm still shaking because I'm so excited. I got up early this morning, got to where I wanted to glass and couldn't turn anything up and I thought I'm gonna get higher. So I got about as high as I could go and I turned the corner and he was at 160 yards. I just hope I got it on camera. I set the camera up and I thought he knew I was there. So I thought, oh, if I'm gonna shoot this bear, I gotta get on him fast. So I put the camera on. I hope, I hope he was in frame when I shot. I'm a little worried he wasn't, but... Woo. I'm so excited. There he is. You can just see his paw sticking up. He's in the thick, absolute thick crap. Just found my bear. Of course he had to go in the thickest stuff. Man. Gorgeous color. So, here's the, as he lies, um, this is my 2017 Idaho bear. <laughs> I'm super happy with him. I wish he wouldn't have died in the thickest, thickest part on the mountain, but that's how it goes. I, uh, I was hunting by myself, all my buddies, my brother, no one could make it. My camera guy couldn't make it, so I'm trying to, to do my best on my own, but uh, I'm so so excited bear down yep yep bear down can you hear me okay <laughs> yeah it's a good bear it's not uh it's not baloo the giant but but uh, it's a good bear it's definitely not a small bear i first ranged him at uh 160 and then he kind of took off a little bit. So my shot was probably at 200 and then the next one was probably 250 or so. Yeah. <laughs> cool, thanks, appreciate it. All right, well, I gotta get to work. Okay, I'll call you in a little bit and I'll try to get a picture through. This has been one of the most physically challenging hunts I've ever done. Oh, oh so glad to be back at the truck. Five miles in, five miles out. The hike in was a lot easier than the hike out.